All right, here we go. We're live right now with Eric Slick. Eric, thank you so much for being here. Thank you for having us. Yeah. So you prepared three songs. I prepared for three us. songs today. Can yes. you tell us about the first one? The first one is called "You Became the Light," and it's about the first time that I ever successfully meditated, which is uh, not a very common song uh, inspiration. But um, I was having so much trouble learning how to meditate. I think if anyone's ever tried to meditate before, people at home. Uh, it can be the most frustrating experience in the world. So this was uh, my experience with it. The first lyric of the song is, I can't open my mind today, which was exactly how I was feeling. <laughs> Couldn't open my mind. Uh, let's do it. All right. Uh, one, two, one, two, three, one, two, three. <laughs> Today, constantly hoping I drift away, be gone. The ocean robs you like a harmless wave to your friend, waiting by the edge. You Our worst moments outweigh the best New days calling softly Like the dormant pain in your chest Never goes to rest I would have known you before I ever said Thank you. Thank you so much. Yeah, thank you. That sounded great. Um, where are you at in your process of learning to meditate? Was that a successful process, an ongoing one? Successful process, yeah. After that, um, that song was the, the first song that I ever wrote after successfully meditating, and it's also the first song I ever finished which is crazy because leading up to that point, my ADHD was so bad that I would get started on a song and I'd be like, and then it would just peter out completely. Uh, you know, I'd go check Instagram, I'd go check Facebook or something. I'd uh, eat a bunch of pretzels. I mean, you name it, I was finding a way to procrastinate from writing. And so uh, You Became the Light was such a monumental moment. It's why I opened uh, my forthcoming album with this song. So it's like... This is it. This is my first song I was actually able to finish. It's crazy. <laughs> it was a good feeling. Well, and so I, you could do worse uh, procrastination-wise than eating pretzels. I mean, pretzels are absolutely delicious. Pretzels are absolutely... That especially you were able to overcome that block and get through that song. Especially the honey wheat pretzels. I don't know if you've ever had like yes, honey wheat pretzels, but oh my God, just dip them in some peanut butter. Oh, I'll never leave home. So you've got a second one coming up, right? You've got uh, The Dirge also. Right? We've got The Dirge, and this song is about uh, when I moved away from Philadelphia. I moved from Philly to Asheville, North Carolina for a year, and this song is about... It's so uh, rock and roll cliche, but it's like, I'm packing up my bags, leaving town. I'm not saying goodbye to anybody. I didn't have a goodbye party. So that's what this song is all about. 
you know, just uh, happy stuff. <laughs> the dirge. One, two, three, four. And it makes you cry Save it for a little while You won't see me again So I'll leave you here Masquerade your hopes and fears you paste thank you wolfgang's vault eric that was great that's a really uplifting melody for a song called the dirge i know that's why i did it (laughs) i was like i'll just call this the dirge put people off that's my plan i'm just trying to put people off that's all well well done (laughs) Um, and so you've got a third uh new tune to play for have these been played anywhere have you played these out in public 
This uh, I've only played them out a couple times, so this is uh, this is a premiere of sorts. Um, it's my first time playing these songs with Katie. Katie's doing such a great job. Welcome, so Katie. welcome, Katie. Katie and I grew up together, so this is very exciting. This is a very cool moment in our lives. <laughs> Um, but yeah, uh, yeah, this is a, a pretty new experience. So I'm just getting it all out, putting it all out there, uh, screaming into a mic. Cool. And so you're playing. Uh, you are. You are not your mind. Next, Pl- right? Playing. You are not your mind. Tell us a little bit about that song. This song is uh, in <laughs> in my uh, quest for self help domination. Um, I read that Eckhart Tolle book, uh, The Power of Now, which is like you can find at a. Uh, like uh, airports or at uh, Michael's Arts and Crafts, um, it's sort of a book. You could, it's kind of like a Bible. You can just kind of find it anywhere. Uh, but there's a, there's a chapter called "You Are Not Your Mind," and I think uh, it's relevant. It was relevant to me then. It's relevant to me now. It's sort of like um, your reactions have absolutely nothing to do with who you are. So it's a way of getting you to control yourself from like overreacting to a situation. So "You Are Not Your Mind" is directly about that. I say. You, the chorus is you are not your mind, you know, take it all in time. Meaning that like, if somebody uh, upsets you, don't uh, freak out. Don't, you know, don't bring out the battle ax. Don't, uh, like our president, you know, don't uh, do a tweet storm when you're uh, impulsively mad about something. Uh, I think it would do people a lot of good to realize that you are not your mind. It's, it's, uh, It's a figment of your imagination. Who you are is a lot better than that. So that's what this song's about. All right, self help. Uh, and it goes like this. <laughs> uh, one, two, three, four. Nothing makes a barrier to the self. Distant carrier of all the pain you'll never feel. Post in the universe, not close, a superior and corroded like a thought, disconnected and distraught. And you know it takes a lot when you're always breathing Don't believe them, you are not your mind Take it all in time, you will not go where everyone tells you to go And the life you lead is blind But having so much shown your way of knowing when to Here and yet, we correct our movement to be right. We will always have our rights. Not immediate, with all the pain you'll never feel. And all the pain, it isn't real. And you know it takes a lot when you're always bleeding Don't believe that you are not your mind Take it all in time, you will not go where everyone tells you to go And the life you lead is blind But having so much on your way of knowing when to live when to die You are not your mind Take it all in time You will not go Where everyone tells you to go And the life you lead is blind Been having so much on your way of knowing When to live or when to die
Thank you. Thank you. Right. Eric, thank you. That was great. Thank you so much. Um, so you're getting a lot of hearts on Facebook. Uh, JCJ Wisniewski, so beautiful. There's a lot of hearts coming from a lot of people. So uh, yeah, good, uh, Ooh, good response. A lot here. of hearts. There's a lot of people that want to see you play these out live. And so you've got, what's confirmed right now? You've got, uh, you'll be at South By, right? I'm going to be at South By Southwest for the Riot Act um, father-daughter um, celebration on March 14th. I think it's at Sidewinder, um, 10 o'clock. And then uh, we've also got two shows with the lovely uh, So Delicate, Delicate Steve on March 9th and 10th. Uh, One is in Philly at Underground Arts. And then the next night, March 10th, is uh, Baltimore Metro Gallery. Um, So we are honored to be opening for Steve because he is a dear, dear friend. Um, oh yeah, we'll be. So we, he's in here next week, so we've got a session with him, and hopefully we cross paths in uh, in Texas. We'll be down there, so uh, maybe we we'll see you down there. You'll catch me, uh, yeah. you know, eating a, a taco at three in the morning. I can't That's wait. Right. <laughs> and can we talk about the um, your other band? Is that a secret? Um, you guys have coming up for uh, for this summer. Uh, that is a secret, that but is, okay. uh, <laughs> that is indeed a secret. Uh, but my other band, Doctor Dog, uh, we just put out a record called Abandoned Mansion, um, and we uh, I just found out we raised forty thousand dollars for the Southern uh, Poverty Law Center uh, a couple days ago. So, uh, wow! Great. Holy moly! Who knew? Yeah, congratulations! Crazy. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, it's crazy. That's that's one piece of information I can give you today. All right, <laughs> cool. Well, thank you so much for being here, and Katie, thank you. That was excellent. Yeah, Katie so. did so well. Thank you. All right, thank you for Come having back. us. See us soon, anytime. Please, thank you.